Good evening to one and all. I am Shikha Shradi, a ninth grader of Abu Dhabi Indian School, Branch 1, Alwadba. Today, I stand before you to speak a few words on NRIs, the building blocks of Indian economy. According to the Income Tax Act of 1961, an Indian citizen settled in a foreign country for employment who is not physically present in the country for more than 240 days in a financial year is regarded as a non-resident Indian or NRI. Today, Indians make up 6.4% of the world's total expat population. The NRI contribution to the Indian economy has been really significant. NRIs have had an important role to play in the development of the country. Every year, thousands of Indians migrate to other countries in search of better prospects for themselves and for their loved ones back home. NRI money transfers to India are channelized towards better education, healthcare, investment, savings and more. Often, NRIs are seen supporting charities and have been instrumental in providing financial assistance in times of natural disasters like the recent floods. Provision of better facilities and access to the wealth raises the standard of living of their families and positively impacts the Indian economy. In 2018, the World Bank estimated remittances of India to be the highest in the world with $79 billion. In the last few years, NRIs have started merging into varied activities in India, including market development such as outsourcing, technology transfer, tourism and other contributions, namely in the political and substantial flows of knowledge. Although India does not rely solely on remittance, the NRI contribution to the Indian economy still constitutes a major part of the country's overall economic development. Non-residents form only a small percentage of the total Indian population but are an integral part in the Indian system. NRI money transfers are a major source of foreign currency inflow in the country. NRI contribution to India's GDP or gross domestic product is significant especially in these times of economic slowdown. For emerging economies like India, international remittances constitute a major source of their gross income and the Indian government has taken steps to encourage NRI money transfers. India has made significant strides in the information age. In this domain, NRIs have contributed immensely to founding and funding new startups and businesses that are not only serving the Indian market but also global markets. Therefore, I conclude that NRIs are the real backbone of the Indian economy. Thank you.